Hi everyone, Eva here. Welcome to another video. I am so happy you decided to join me today. I have a very special video. I am going to be sharing a recipe an iridologist, a world-renowned iridologist shared with me when I went to see her just recently for a consultation. And I also have her interview on my channel, so you might want to check her out. Her name is Dr. Ellen Tart Jensen. She's a world-renowned iridologist, and when I went to see her, she, my eyes revealed to her that my liver needs a little work. My liver needs a little work. Here I am six years into my raw vegan journey, you guys, and it keeps changing, evolving. Things are not, it took 40 plus years to get me into the mess that I was in, and it's not going to take two, three, four years to get me out of that mess. It's still happening. I'm still cleansing. I'm still detoxing. And my liver showed some signs that I could use with a little uh, TLC to my liver, even though I had done liver cleanses in the past at the very beginning of my journey. Evidently, I need to work on my liver a little bit, which is something that I had obviously not even, if I hadn't gone to see her, I would not have known. So she gave me a recipe for this a liver cleansing smoothie, this liver repairing, this liver TLC smoothie, if you will. And the magic ingredient in that smoothie is beet. Beet is extremely cleansing to the liver, you guys. Fresh beet. This had the green tops. I just removed the green tops because I use them for juicing. It stains everything it touches, you guys, so be careful with your uh, cutting boards. But Here's the recipe. It's simple, it's delicious, and I've been having this about three times a week. So in your blender, you're going to add a little bit of milk, and this is hemp milk, and she recommended hemp milk to me. I have been using nut milks in lieu of water in my smoothies. Why? To add a little bit more protein, to add a few more, a few more nutrients and minerals. So next is going to go a banana and this could be a little riper but it'll have to do so banana goes in there next is going to be a cup of blueberries next is going to be a cucumber I'm gonna do about half an organic cucumber next is going to be a little lemon squeeze next is going to be a kale leaf I'm gonna take the stem out in the interest of a smoother smoothie and I do juice these. Next is going to be half a green apple. Next is going to be a celery stalk. Next is going to be a little bit of cilantro and cilantro, you guys, is such a good blood cleanser. And then you guys, the magic ingredient, of course, is beet. This is what gets your liver cleansed. This is a powerful liver cleanser. I'm going to do about half of this massive beet. If you guys are concerned about the taste, you can always add a couple of dates. Okay, it's ready. It's going to be probably my breakfast because I haven't had anything to eat. So here it is. First of all, it smells delicious. And second of all, look at the color. You guys, if you're concerned about the taste, you can always add a couple of dates here and there, but honestly, to me, mm, 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 mm. it doesn't eat anything. Mm. Beets are sweet, so it's kind of like a, it's sweet, it's a sweet smoothie, even with a cucumber, even with a celery, even with a kale, it's very good, you guys. So, this is <laughs> my new favorite smoothie, I hope you have enjoyed this recipe. Drop me a comment below if there's anything you would do to change this recipe, let me know if you try it, tag me on social media if you do. And thank you so much, you guys, for being here with me today. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so and give this video a big thumbs up. Thank you. I really appreciate you. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm.